So I just got a comment on YouTube um, asking me to make a video um, about applying to college with the Penn Foster High School diploma. So let me go ahead and talk about that. I really want to make sure that everybody gets, gets their questions answered. So this is how it works. Um, as for me, I found the colleges I was choosing. When I went to Full Sail, understand I was, there was such a big confusion regarding that. Um, and the reason why was because my old high school diploma in 2008, uh, Nevada took it back from me. So I was balancing both high school and college at the same time, Penn Foster and Full Sail University at the same time. Once I completed that, then I went ahead and submitted that to, um, to Full Sail University. So to the to, to one comment that I got, that's how I balanced high school and um, college at the same time. Um, for uh, comment number two, applying to college with a Penn Foster High School diploma, this is how it works, sit. Um, this is how it works. You find the college that you want to go to. Once you find the college that you want to go to, you have to ask the your admissions representative, do you accept a Penn Foster High School diploma? They look into the system and it kind of like tells them all of the uh, accredited schools or high schools that they will accept a high school diploma from. Now, um, understand that Penn Foster is regionally and nationally accredited. So as far as I know and from what they've told me is that Penn Foster is accepted throughout the nation, which includes New York. I've gotten a comment that said that New York did not take uh, Penn Foster. So, uh, I did follow up with them and then, of course, I got a different answer. Now, um, continuing on the comment about how to apply for a college with a high school, with the Penn Foster High School diploma, that's how you do it. Um, they'll look, they'll, they have, either they have a book or they go into a system that tells them a list, literally, a list of schools um, that they do accept and Penn Foster should be on there. They'll give you the A-OK. -okay. You go ahead and start the, the, the original process, fill out your FAFSA, um, then that tells you how much FAFSA, if you've never taken out FAFSA before, um, that's where the government gives you student loans to go ahead and go to school later on, six months after and more, uh, you, you work on paying that back after you graduated. You do not pay that student loan as you're in high school. You don't, some of them don't have a job while they're in and um, so once you graduate, then six months after, then you start your process on doing that, that repayment. Um, you can make it as low as you need to so it can fit for you. That's how you work with um, applying, and that's pretty much it. That's how you work with applying for a college. Um, again, uh, you can go to a university. I went to Full Sail University. It was not a community college. Um, that was in Florida, and I'm now going to a, a trade school now, a vocational school, I guess you can say. Um, at Concord Career College. This is my second college that I'm going to. Um, I did look into my bachelor's degree once I'm done with my physical therapy assistance degree. Um, my bachelor's degree, I'm looking at doing that at Concordia University, and they accept the Penn Foster High School diploma, as well as um, uh, University of St. Augustine, again, which is a university, so they also accept the Penn Foster High School diploma. Um, let me see, San Diego State University accepts the Penn Foster High School diploma. So when you get people that say, oh, it's not real, or, oh, it's, 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 um, there's a whole bunch of colleges that won't accept it, or you can't go to a university uh, with a Penn Foster High School diploma, I am a living witness, and then that is false. You can. I went to Full Sail University, Concord Career College, and I've checked into the other two colleges that I want to go to, both for my bachelor's degree and for my doctorate degree. My doctorate degree, that's the highest degree you can get. A doctorate degree um, that I'm going for with a Penn Foster um, high school diploma. I have shown many uh, throughout the videos. If you guys find it, I've shown my high school, my um, 2008 high school diploma. I've shown my uh, Penn Foster high school diploma, and I've also shown my um, I've also shown my um, what is it? Uh, my adult ed uh, high school diploma. Comment three: If I had my Penn Foster high gave the backstory on that. The purpose of that was because once I had completed my Penn Foster High School diploma, Clark County in Las Vegas had announced that they were doing a retroactive high school diploma, which meant if you completed all of your credits and you did not pass your proficiencies, I was one point from one um, math 304, I got a 303, 
That's the reason why they took my high school diploma in 2008. In the first place, um, they said they would they were doing away with proficiencies and they would give it to you. I didn't have to go back, but I went back because I put all my work in it and I wanted what was right for money anyway. I did not need it. I just got it, honestly, just to get it. Um, so that's how I got that one. So again, I am a living witness that you can go to a university and you can go to, um, hell, I even went to see I'm a living witness that it is possible. Um, all right, there you go. Thanks, man. Bye.